we have a new right hand rule. If you have an infinitely long current carrying wire that is carrying current out of the board, this has a magnetic field that exists around it, just like we showed with the Biot Savart law, but this is a way to do it that's a little bit easier. So you take your thumb of your right hand, you point it in the direction of the current, and your fingers curl in the direction of the magnetic field. So this current carrying wire has a magnetic field that exists around the wire that looks like this. This is the direction of the magnetic field. We could do the same thing with a current carrying wire if the current is into the page, then your fingers are going to curl this way and the magnetic field in this case is going to be the opposite direction. So it's going to go this way around the current carrying wire. I also want to make sure we look at it from this perspective, which is if we have a current carrying wire that's carrying current to the right, we point our thumb in the direction of the current. We curl our fingers in the direction of the magnetic field. Notice that that means that above the wire, the magnetic field is going to be out of the page. And the magnetic field below the wire is going to be into the board. And we have just figured out the value of that magnetic field. It's equal to mu naught i over 2 pi a. In other words, it is going to decrease as we get farther away from the current carrying wire. So the way we would illustrate that is actually by writing it like that. Because it's decreasing as we get farther away from the wire. A couple things to notice about magnetic field lines. Magnetic field lines do not have to start and end on magnetic poles. In fact, they are, and I'm going to put always in quotes, um, closed loops. The reason they are always closed loops is because we have never found a magnetic mon monopole. If we someday find a magnetic monopole, we will find a location where there is a, um, where the magnetic field ends at that pole. But because we've never found a magnetic monopole, as far as we know, uh, magnetic fields are always closed loops. <laughs>